are you guys looking forward to in the scavenger hunt today? Yes! What are you looking forward to? I was looking forward to looking for the treasure. <laughs> just looking for the things that are, have, were on the sheet and just seeing the excitement of our son. And spending time in nature, finding. I can't wait to go into the woodland! <laughs> Can you tell me um, what this what the scavenger hunt thing is and what what you do for it? Sure, you just come here anytime between the hours of 11 a.m. and 3 p.m. here at Farbach Warner Nature Preserve, and you'll pick up a scavenger hunt sheet. And um, it's just basically to introduce people to the park, to get them to walk around and enjoy the um, the trails and the grounds. And you just look for different things. You don't have to collect anything. You just keep track of what you're looking at as you go and then when you're finished you come back for a prize. Well, how are you guys enjoying the scavenger hunt today? We're having a good time finding lots of stuff. This is our first time here just getting started. But we've been enjoying this park this summer. We've been coming to all of the different Nature Week activities. We've seen the owls, the turtles, snakes, frogs. So it's been a fun summer. How are you guys enjoying the scavenger hunt today and what did you guys find so far? Uh, well, it's pretty cool and so far we found uh, numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, 8, and 9, and 11. Do you want to point the paper to the thing towards me so we can show me? We found this, 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 this and Hmm, yeah, I think Which that's pretty much... Which part part? The recycling can was a little too easy. <laughs> yeah. And how are you and your kids enjoying it? Eh, it's okay. They're a little whiny, yeah. but they're getting into it slowly. It's okay. Um, we're hoping to kind of find everything that's on this paper. We're hoping to, you know, just get, find the things that we might not have noticed before. You guys just find it pretty fun to, to be involved with nature and all kinds of stuff, find these treasures and everything? Uh, yeah, we want our kids to um, learn all the things that they can out here and, you know, kind of be a hands-off approach and um, just let them learn through playing within their environment. It's right there. Right here. How many years have you guys been doing this event? Oh, gosh. More than 10 years, I would say. I would say more than 10 years. I personally been at this location for about five. We guys hoping to, to do for, for this event in the future? What was that? I'm sorry. What are you guys hoping to do for this event in the future? Um, you know, this is a really popular event. This tends to be a week that a lot of people have time off with their families. So it's kind of a nice way to get people to come together as a family and enjoy the outdoors. And, um, you know, again, just have a lot of family time together. So um, we probably will continue to do this next year. I know you guys said you guys are almost done with the scavenger hunt. What did you guys found in the scavenger hunt? What did we find, guys? We found... Um, uh, this butterfly weed, um, we found tons of insects, bamboo, 
Lots of poison ivy. Poison ivy. Um, a pond. Goldfish. How many times have you guys been to this casual hunt before? This is our first time. Mm -hmm. And how are you kids enjoying it? Fun. <laughs> They're having a good time. <laughs> So far today, we have had a grand total of just over 117 people, um, and we still have got a few hours left to go. What would you tell people on YouTube that want to come here next year, that are watching this on TV, that want to come here next year? I would definitely recommend it. It's a great way to get outside and enjoy nature. It's nice and shady, and um, the paved um, walkway is great for strollers, so it's really family friendly. Tell them that it's a, it was a great experience to come on out and bring their children out so that they can experience, you know, just walking through this beautiful land, finding the different things that are on the scavenger hunt sheet. Yeah, I think it's a really great educational opportunity, too, for children because there's lots to read, lots to discover, so I would definitely recommend it. Oh, we'd love to have you. This is a fun little place. Um, we do theme weeks all through the summer, and it starts with Memorial Day weekend and then we um, we start with frog week then we have snake week then turtle week then owl week this is scavenger hunt week now we take a week off <laughs> and then we have nature play week um, in a couple of weeks and then nature arts and crafts weeks after that so we um, we try to do a lot of kid friendly things throughout the summer and actually throughout the year but the summer we really um, have a pretty aggressive program schedule